Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about your Calendly account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you connect your Google Meet to your Calendly account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you want to connect your Google Meet to Calendly anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're making money online selling coaching services, you know that Calendly is an easy way to set that up. And if you connect your Google Meet, it's automatically going to be populated as the location of the Meet. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's actually handled here in your Calendly account. Check my video description. I'll try to leave all the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my Calendly account. As you can see, this is the home page. Now here on the home page, if you want to connect your Google Meet to Calendly, here on the left bar, you're going to see these four little dots here towards the bottom. Go ahead and click on there. Once you click there, you will see all of the integrations that are available on Calendly. However, in order to connect your Google Meet, you need to scroll down until you see this button here called Google Meet. It's like a colorful camera, I guess. Go ahead and click on there. Okay, guys, in order to connect your Google Meet into Calendly, that's actually set up through your Google Calendar. So you do need to connect a Google Calendar in order for this to work. So go ahead and click on Connect Google Calendar. Okay, next you're going to see this drop down and click on Google Calendar Connect. Okay, next you want to choose the account that you are going to be working in if you have more than one Gmail like I do. So I'll choose this one right here. Okay, next you have to agree to the privacy policy and terms of service. So click on continue. Okay, next Google does let you know that Calendly will be able to see, edit, share, and permanently delete all of the calendars that you give them access to. If you're okay with that, go ahead and click on allow. Okay, a quick second later, the page refreshes into your calendar sync. You can see my calendar is now added right there. So let me switch back over here to integrations. Okay, so here we are back in the integrations. And if you scroll down to Google Me, click on here. Okay, as you can see, the Google Me is now connected because I connected my Google Calendar. So now I can use my Google Me as a location for my appointments. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to connect your Google Me to your Calendly, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.